There's a couple of reasons we do the, the boat checks uh, every hour. One is to make sure nothing is going wrong. As far as you come in here, you're going to know pretty quickly if something's wrong. Either it's going to be on fire, smoking, or generally terribly unpleasant. And that's going to be your first clue that uh, it's a really good idea to get somebody. But we also, in effect, take a bunch of statistics that we can work with later. We keep a careful eye on the voltage because when it drops below a certain level, the lights go out and we have uh, it's a real pain in the ass to get everything back online. We keep an eye on the generator to make sure that it is not overheating. Now, it's got a lot of safety shutdowns, but all things can fail. We keep an eye on the amount of fuel in the day tank. If we're under power in a narrow or confined place, and uh, we let the fuel run out of the day tank, the engine will stop, and mayhem and uh, calamity may result when we uh, lose control of the ship. We also check the bilge to make sure we're not taking on water into the ship. So there's a place where they look down into the bilges to make sure that we're not uh, slowly sinking. We also record the temperature of our freezer and our refrigerator. All of these, of course, have a parameter associated with them. There's two sort of maintenance schemes. One is uh, planned or scheduled, and then we have a separate kind of thing that happens where people come to us with uh, something's broken or not working correctly, or something uh, is working but not as well as it should, and then we have to slip into the um, troubleshooting mode, trying to find out what's wrong and how to fix it, or how to, if we can't fix it, how to work around it.